I'm sure you saw the big news alert today that the stock market had its biggest single day drop ever. Well, that's not exactly true. Here's what really happened and how it compares to the history of the stock market. Today, the Dow dropped 1,175 points, which is the most in history. However, because the stock market is so high, it was only a 4.6% drop. The percentage, much more important than the raw number. In fact, that 4.6% doesn't even crack the top 20 worst days of all time. For example, back in 2008, the Dow Jones dropped 777 points, which was a 7% drop. Back in 1987, the worst day ever, 508-point drop, which was a 22% loss. So the big question now is, why did it drop today? Well, some experts are saying it's fears of inflation, increased uh, interest rates, amplified by the automated computer sell-offs. I think it's because Tom Brady lost. Okay, so now you understand today's drop a little better, but you're still worried about your money in the market. Have no fear. We spoke to a local financial expert who says it's best to just kind of ride this one out. You've got to save for the long haul. Don't make decisions off the short run. Think about the long haul. 7 to 10 percent is normally what stocks will get you over a long period of time. It's never even. It's never straight line upward. There's always going to be corrections. Uh, corrections happen. They're very normal. They're very healthy. They're very good.